just making videos. Just making videos and telling guys to stop talking. That's all. Where's your phone? Making an effort. What? All right. Um. What I like to do, guys, is remember I was asking to find the complement and the supplement, right? So remember, when we're trying to find the complement and supplement, just look, think back in your geometry days. Complement was two angles that add up to give you 90 degrees, right? And the supplement was two angles that add up to give you a straight angle. So just think about that. Whenever you see that, think about it in your head. However, we're not dealing with 90 degrees and 180 degrees when we talk about radians. What we're talking about is we're dealing with radians. So what we're gonna be dealing with is if you think about the unit circle, well, 90 degrees is what we call pi over two radians. And all the way over 180 degrees is what we call pi radians. So therefore, if I wanna find um, what the complement and the supplement is, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to uh, subtract so let's say I want to find the complement of this. Well, pi over 1 12th is going to be you know, roughly there. So to find the complement, I'm going to subtract from uh, pi over 2. So I'll say pi over 2 minus pi over 12. And if I want to find the supplement, all I'm going to do is I'm going to take pi and subtract uh, pi over 12. Oh. Well, I'm just doing this problem right now. Does everybody understand why I'm subtracting? Mm -hmm. Or do you want me to show you that again, Mark? You guys understand to subtract? Because remember, if I'm giving you, if I give you this angle, you need us to say 90 minus this angle is going to give me the remaining angle. So if you have one angle, subtract it from your whole to get the other part, right? If you have the whole, if you have one angle, subtract it from your whole to get your part. So now these don't have the same denominator, so I have to multiply by six over six. So I get six pi over twelve minus pi over twelve equals five pi over twelve. This I have to multiply by twelve over twelve, and so I get twelve pi over 12 minus pi over 12, which equals 11 pi over 12. Over here, if you guys notice, 11 pi over 12, that's almost 12 over 12, right? So that's almost a whole pi. So that angle is roughly right there. So you can't add anything to 11 pi over 12 to get it to 90 degrees. Well, another positive angle. So therefore, this does not have a complement. Why not? Because <laughs> it's already <coughs> over 90 degrees. Remember, the complement is what two angles oh. add up to 90 degrees, right? Yeah. So if you have an angle that's greater than 90 degrees, it doesn't have a positive complement. So this one's none. And then to find the supplement, this thing sucks right now. This. <coughs> So there, find this find the supplement. You take 180 degrees, which in radians is what we call pi, and you subtract your angle. And again, we have to multiply. Since these don't have the same denominator, multiply by 12 over 12, and what you get is pi over 12. Any questions? Anything? No. Nope. Kind of a good reminder.